Hi, this is Keith Fredericks, and I'm coming to you from General 3D in Jena, Germany. I just want to give a quick demonstration of how to locally view a Fujifilm MPO file. I have my Fujifilm W1 camera, and I have a setup with a MacBook Pro computer connected to a Panasonic uh, Plasma 3D TV through an HDMI cable. And what I'm going to do is show local viewing of uh, an MPO file from the, the Fujifilm uh, camera. So I'll just take out my SD card from the Fujifilm camera, <clears throat> put it into my SD slot on the MacBook Pro. We'll wait for that to mount. <clears throat> and I'll clean up here. Okay, and I find the MPO file that I want on the SD card and I copy it to a directory on my MacBook Pro. Okay, now I'm going to execute a conversion program to convert the MPO file to a side by side JPEG file. And so I just run this convert. MPO program and it's working right now converting the MPO file into a side-by-side -side JPEG and we just need to wait a moment while this well, this finishes, and there it is. The conversion is complete, and here is my side-by-side -side JPEG file. Now, as you can see, what I have displayed here is some of my files uh, from 3D Feed, and I've already got the Panasonic in side-by-side -side 3D mode here on the, uh, on the desktop. So you can see, uh, display uh, any of my files from, from uh, 3D feed directly from the website. But what if I have a file that I don't want to upload to the web? Well, with the 3D feed photo viewer, the photo player, we can just drag and drop the side-by-side -side file that we created from the Fujifilm MPO file we can drop that directly onto the player and let's see that let's try that again okay dropping that onto the player okay and here we go and all we need to do then is detach this file drag it over to my panasonic side-by-side -side enabled 3D display, bring it up to full screen, put on my Panasonic shutter glasses, make sure that they're turned on, make sure, there we go, and we got a full 3D picture of some shots that we took uh, recently. So there you have it, that's the, how to convert the Fujifilm MPO file from the Fujifilm W1 uh, should also work with the W3 using the conversion program um, on the MacBook Pro and uh, then just dragging and dropping using 3D feed in the browser and this was uh, using Chrome 9. So that's all for now.